Solo Sokoa, a prominent member of WWE's The Bloodline faction, hails from the renowned Inoai wrestling family. Despite speculation linking him to Amaga due to his consistent homage to the fellow Samoan in the ring, it is essential to clarify that Solo Sokoa's father is WWE Hall of Famer Rikishi. Also known as Solo Fafatu Jr. alongside Sokoa, Rikishi is the father of Jimmy and Jey Uso, making them part of this legendary wrestling lineage. Umaga, on the other hand, is Solo's and the Uso's uncle. In 2018, Solo Sokoa embarked on his wrestling journey under the guidance of his father. His NXT debut in 2021 marked a significant milestone, propelling him into the WWE main roster. Initially a face during his time in the developmental brand, Sokoa underwent a transformation upon joining the bloodline, emerging as the quintessential heel star aligned with Roman Reigns. His unwavering loyalty to Reigns has solidified his role as the enforcer within the faction. While lacking a direct familial connection, Sokoa and Umaga share a profound bond rooted in their shared history and wrestling heritage. Despite his relatively young age and the trajectory of his professional career still unfolding, Solo Sokoa has already secured success within the Stanford-based promotion. Despite being in the early phases of his career at 30 years old, Solo Sokoa's affiliation with the Bloodline Coalition has ensured his regular presence in the weekly main event scene. While championship victories on SmackDown have eluded him so far, he did secure the NXT North American Championship just before transitioning to the main roster. Addressing the comparisons to his uncle Amaga, Sokoa has embraced them openly. In a recent interview with Sports Illustrated, he acknowledged the parallels and declared that, much like his uncle, he harbors no fear when it comes to facing any opponent. The heavy machinery, the juggernaut, that's who I am. I want that fight, anytime, anywhere. Umaga wasn't scared to fight anyone. Neither am I. I'm supposed to be here, he said. I'm not going to run away from something I was born to do. Roman was born to be a champion. The Usos were born to be the greatest tag team champions. We were born to do this. Now we're doing it for real. Share your opinions in the comments section below on whether you think Solo Sokoa has the potential to become a world champion in the future and if you are new to the channel make sure to hit that subscribe button and click on the bell icon for more interesting updates like this in future. Till then see you all in the next one. Thanks.